nice, nice. Just making sure everything's not thick and span. Hold on, I got some onions. Went through a little bit of a day, especially since we our last episode it was a little bit of a nightmare. Um, not so much a nightmare, but still uh, pretty, uh, pretty intense. It's like having sex in a campground. Intense. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and rub you down. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back in Cooking Simulator. It's out now for everybody to enjoy. Go ahead and head over to Steam. Link is in the description down below if you want to, by uh, all means, go ahead and check it out. It's there. It's ready for you. For you and yours. Oh, this is, such a, this is such a mess. I was breaking so many bottles in my little warm-up. My little warm-up here. Uh, we have so many recipes, bro. Cumin. We don't really use cumin that much. For one recipe and one recipe alone. Black pepper time. I just gotta rearrange some of this stuff. I like to have everything available. Got some sugar. White pepper. Just trying to use it. Trying to dish out the, the the most used. Oh no. Ew. That grease has been sitting overnight. Y'all know that's gonna be a problem. Uh I don't know what we'll need for the tuna. We just got this brand new uh, dish, but steak and fries is the meal of the day because we're American, and that's American as apple pie is, is, is steak and french fries, you know what I'm saying? Nothing sets the flavor off of a steak like some ketchup. Uh, everyone just got, everyone just gagged in their mouth a little bit, I understand. Um, let's see. Broth, broth. We're going to need more broth. I can feel it. I just knew. We're gonna need some broth. Someone's gonna order some tomato soup, but we also have another dish that uh, requires a big vat of chicken broth, and that's the uh, the 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 sliced potatoes. Yeah. All right. So let's get preparation phase. Let's jump into the weeds, son. Give me the first dish. Oh, we got some mustard. That's what's up. Hey, and it's the order of the day: steak and French fries. All right. Let's go ahead and snag the steaks up here. Close you. And let's get some pepper. One, two, three, four, five. And salt, salt. Where is the salt? There, it's number one. It's number one, everybody. One, two, three, four, five. Now, before I go ahead and start frying that up, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna grab our basket. We're just going to place this here. I noticed that it goes all the way back there and it's very, very... <laughs> it's, my, my butthole parkers up every single time that I think it's a little too close to the edge because if that falls, it's uh, pretty hard to get get it back. And I don't want to have that happen. I did. I did want to have that happen. Don't, don't, don't. One. We got Julianne these fries. I don't know what's up with Julianne. She likes these fries this way. So she gets them this way. This is her way, not mine. These are some of the thickest julienne fries you ever did put your mouth on. I'll tell you that much right now. Go ahead and write that down. Because it's how they want it. It's how they need it. It's how they're going to get it, to be honest with you. Let's go ahead and fill that up. And we'll go ahead and turn you on. Crank it up, baby. Yes, fry, fry. So it says 45 seconds per side. Oh, the steak is almost done. It's almost done. One, two, three, four, five. Let's grab that steak. She's almost ready, my friends. Grab you. Nice. Turn that off, my friend, my friend, my friend. My friend, I don't know what happened over here with all these fries on the on the ground. And I hate it when you can't place this thing. And we're going to put it all the way close to the edge. I'm trying not to lose my head. I burnt the potatoes a little bit. I would say burnt the potatoes as I seasoned the potatoes a little bit better than they, uh, than they were. And you should all be like, way to go. And one... To, that should be just plenty fine. We need rosemary sprigs. One, two. 
two. Put it on the plate. It's a work, a work of art. They don't. They do not. Agree, they do not agree. <laughs> it's not bad. It's, it could be worse. Three and a half stars. Guest complaints. Steak technique. Heating mistakes. I don't know. It says that I cooked it to completion. I may have to bust out the timer every once in a while. But it was close. It was close. Let's go ahead and drain this because it's gross. And we'll move you. Steak and french fries again. All right. All right. All right. Oh my god! Oh my god, everything's on fire. Shut up. The steak, she's burning. Ugh. What have I done? Okay, so we gotta try and pick up the pieces. It's like a nine inch nail song. It's not enough, it's not much fun unless we pick up the pieces. Oh my god. Is there glass in those potatoes? There might be. There might be. Oh, is the health inspector here? I really hope the health inspector is not here. Alright. That's almost done. So, I'm just gonna set this down nicely. Hot, 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 hot. I'm just going to put you in there. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Okay. We got a mess to clean up and another dish to make. Um, we need rosemary sprigs. One, two. We're probably not going to like the amount of french fries, but you know what? It's either french fries or glass. Tell them to take the uh, more, more steak and french fries. What did they give me? What did they give me? Three stars. Uh, I found a piece of glass in my french fries. Excuse me? You heard me. Yeah, I totally uh, I burnt that a little bit. Too much salt. How dare you? How dare you tell me too much salt? It's ridiculous. There's no such thing. That went a little bit better. No broken glass this time. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think, customer? Still three stars. Really? Really, I cooked that thing. I cooked that thing to perfection. Technique was perfect. You know what I'm saying? Too much black pepper and too much salt. That's what. There's like one extra gram. I, good job. I guess when to compliment on your skills, you don't get used to it. Oh well, they should get uh, used to telling me that I'm great. Ah, uh, let's see. Take the cod. Oh my god. Oh, we got tuna, tuna, tuna. All right. So take the cod. 160 cc of salt. Yeah, 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 yeah. Salt. Three grams of salt. One, two, three. And we got this giant mess over here. One, two, three. Three things of pepper. Uh, sweet bell pepper. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now we will have to fry this. And... Oh, that's, oh, that's five, sorry. I'm sorry, pan sear it and then bake it. And now we got tuna, so I'm not sure exactly what we gotta do for that. Cumin. Cumin. Five of cumin. Mark cumin. Alright. Let's go ahead and we shall fry you up, my friend. Whoo! Alright, and then we're going to need to get the baking tray. Lemon. lemon we got some potatoes, some lemon slices. Looking good. Alright, so also for tuna. Salt, pepper, grill each side. Let's put to a plate, cut lemon slices. Oh, that's so simple. Why can't that all why, why can't they all be like that? Uh, let's grab this baking tray. Transfer to the baking tray. Now, we're gonna need to... Oh no, we're gonna need to, to, to season this up. I, got, I, I broke all the things. Um, let's see, lemon juice. Did that survive? It did. How many? Five? Yes. Let's 
six milliliters. It's gonna be fine. We'll get through it. Um, olive oil, olive oil. Did that make it? It did not. Olive oil broke. We need olive oil. And how much? Five? You said five. Five. Clarified butter made it too. Beautiful. It looks like the olive oil we just demolished. Put you there. Woo. Clarified butter. Let's just be clear. I just want to be clear. I just want to clarify. This butter is clarified, right? Boot. Badoo, badoo. We're almost there. One more. Just put a dash. A spritz. That'll work too. All right. Pop you here. Hello. Thank you. It's like hello, Bueller. Crank it up. All right. So tuna, tuna. Where is the tuna? Your tuna. All right. Let's season this. Let's season this on the countertop. We're clean. Everything's clean. Salt and pepper. It couldn't be simpler. One, two, three, four, five. And where did I put the salt? Salt. It's right there. One, two, three, four, five. Pop that there. I'm going to turn you off. What is this looking like now? The cod is looking aight. Let's go ahead and grab a plate. Put that there. Watch out for the glass. We're good. Let's crank that up. Out, hot, hot, hot hand, hot hand. I got a hot hand here. And then we have to garnish this with parsley leaves. Let's make sure that we give them a lemon. Four lemon slices. And one, two, three. It's a masterpiece. They should enjoy this. Enjoy this. Hey, four stars. I'll take it. I'll take it. After the scores we've been getting today, I will take it. Uh, let's go ahead and clean this off here real quick. Whew. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, more steak, and, more steak and french fries. Get out of town. You, you will pop you on. We got our seasoned tuna. Grill for 80 seconds each side. Transfer onto a plate. Serve hot lemon slices. More lemon slices. They love the lemon slices. Good, good. Let's go ahead and put these potatoes in here. I'll tell you what. Let's grab these since we already have a bunch of potatoes done. Let's see if I could try to skirt around. Oh, hold on. This is like the five minute rule. Don't tell anybody, especially OSHA or anybody who is says, says they're an inspector. We've got all these french fries over here. Too. Oh my goodness, hold on a second. How are we? How are we doing? Really? Seems like we should probably put that in for a little bit longer. But you know what? Let's see if we can work our, without having to work. Oh, that one's already, that one's already done. I'll tell you what, we'll make one, well, let's cook one potato. I just flipped it one more time because we didn't leave it on there for the full, the full 40, 80 seconds, 80 seconds. Is There's so many fries that are around here. Uh, let's go ahead and grab a steak because it's our special of the day. And let's go ahead and we'll put on some black pepper. And we'll put on some salt. Perfect. And what are you looking like? Oh my god, let's grab you. You should be all done. Someone's going to have a problem with this. I just know that they will. Let's grab these lemons. Super lemons. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Oh, and how, how are we to prepare this? Oregano twigs. Oregano. One. Two. I said they need eight grams. Yes. It's perfect. It's gorgeous. It's done. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Let me know. Ooh, it's terrible. <laughs> Ta
technique was trash. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I didn't heat it up correctly. Just stick it in your mouth and enjoy it. Not the first time I've ever said that. Uh, let's go over here. We need to fry it up. Come on, baby. Come on. You get you get cooking good. Bang. I'll take that. I'll turn you off. Ow, it's hot. It's hot. It's hot, but I have, I have wonderful hands. Ask, ask anybody. And can we take our already cut up potatoes? Some of these were on the floor. Shh, don't, don't, don't say anything, okay? Ugh, you know what? Nailed it. Oh no, not the basket! Two rosemary twigs, slowly, slowly, so the french fries don't fall off. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Hey, we're better than just a three-star meal. Hey, all right. Give me that nine cooking points. I'm not sure what the heating mistakes are. I don't know what they're talking about. Because I did exact. Oh, we're, so we're done for the day. Uh, I did exactly everything that they wanted me to do. I don't know what the problem is. Oh, you know what? I got a perk. Let me see something here real quick. We have a magic wand perk. Magic wand? Hocus pocus. Put them together and what do you got? Bibbidi babidi boo. Oh. That's so perfect. That cuts that cuts a lot of that cuts quite the cleaning time. Very excited about that. Um, is it, can I get my basket? I sure can't. I can't reach it. Help. If things fall behind there, I, oh, we got it. Oh, this is going to be so clutch. And we still got stuff on the floor. Can I use this again? We're like magic, my friends, my friends, my friends. It's so good. It's too good. Just too good to me. Um, let's go ahead and just grab some repairs real quick. Let's call for you. You're good. You should be good in a couple seconds here, too. Got an achievement saying I need to be more careful. No, no, no. I'm just making sure everything is on the up and up. Gotta make sure all the repairs are in there, sport. Everything. Oh my god, there's, we have no chicken broth. And we are ready for tomorrow's gig. Ah, uh, what a good day. Please tell me how good of a day we had. Boom! Give me some fame points. I think we might have a critic coming in here, too. Expenses. Lost $142, but we made total income $444, $445. Tip income 52 because... <gasps> Our dishes were trash, but still gave us a bunch of fame points, expenses, and we made a bunch of money. Tomorrow we're going to be visited by a food critic and press him and everyone's going to hear about us. I'll be waiting. Nice. Oh, so close to level 10, bro. All right, choose some skills. What do we got here? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Quest reward boost, cheaper kitchen decor. I don't really care for the dish streak. No, fame boost, cheaper liquids, cheaper products. Cheap repairs, cheaper spices, better tips. Guest tips are 20%, 40%, 60% larger. Equipment repairs. How about people are le least, uh, are, are more lenient? Dish taste tolerance is increased. I will take all of those points. Extended cleaning phase. Nah, I don't really need that much. Extended overtime, which does work out for us. Uh, duration of preparation phase is extended. Uh, serve time for dishes is extended. Products need two. Oh, we only have one point to, to spend, though. Equipment breaks something slower. You lose 10. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Cleaning. Equipment repairs. Cheaper. You earn more fame points. Or kitchen decorations. Let's go for fame points. Fame boost. Let's do it. Day 10. Don't worry about it. It's going to be fine. 
Our baked trout is quite popular, so I've made it stay special. Yes, baked trout is easy to make, and people enjoy it. Folks, that is going to be our episode for today. We got a magic wand. We were making some new tuna. Things got a little bit hectic, and uh, I think it was, it was fantastic. We made a little bit of a mess, but since we have a magic wand... Not to worry about, uh, don't, don't you worry your pretty head about, about all the cleaning that has to be done. For sure. But again, Cookie Simulator is out. I'm going to put this on. Uh, yeah, we'll be fine. Uh, Cookie Simulator is, is out right now on Steam. The link is in the description down below. And uh, enjoy yourself. And hop us in the Discord. Show us your dishes, baby. You can take photos of them. Take a photo of your dish. It'll be fantastic. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button, helps out my channel ever so much more than you know, and if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos are coming out every single day, every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, a good night. Peace out, like shout, y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Cooking Simulator next time.